Let's learn how to fix any Snapchat bug. So if you are experiencing problems with the Snapchat application and you have bugs while using it, then let's learn how to solve that issue. I'm gonna show you a couple of different methods so just follow my steps. The first step that we will do is to open any web browser on our device. I'm on my iPhone so I'll open Safari, but you can open anything you want. Now in the search bar, we want to type is Snapchat down. And now, in the search results, you need to find the website called Down Detector. This is the website where people report problems and outages that different apps may have. You want to scroll down until you can see this little graph. This is a graph with reported problems and bugs that people are facing with Snapchat during the different times of the day. If you see a big spike right around your time, then that means that they have a problem with the servers or some other issues. The issue isn't on your side, but the company's. So all you have to do is to wait a couple of hours until they resolve the issue with the servers or other problems that they are facing. But if you don't see a spike, then maybe the problem is on your side. The next step that you can do is to type speed test in the search bar and simply open any of these websites to measure your internet speed. Maybe you have a problem with your Wi-Fi or mobile data, so we have to check our internet speed. If you have a 5 megabyte or more download speed, you should be good because that's more than enough for Snapchat. But if you have a weak internet that's maybe 1 or 2 megabytes, you may want to switch to another Wi-Fi network or enable the mobile data if you can. If your internet was bad, then that's why Snapchat had bugs or it won't refresh and other stuff. But if you have a good connection and still have problems with Snapchat, then we'll go to our device's settings, then open the general section. Now open this iPhone storage list and find Snapchat from this application list. If you are on your iOS device, then we're gonna offload the app. But if you are an Android user, then you want to clear the cache inside of Snapchat. Delete the app from your phone and then reinstall it by going to the Google Play Store. But we're on our iPhone so just offload the app and then reinstall it. This will give our app a fresh new installation and it will get rid of the cache, bugs and unnecessary data that the app may have. And that's it for this video everyone. If this video was helpful, then leave a comment down below and I'll see you in the next video.